Hey guys, so I had a follower ask me to talk about bands that show up to the gig with new gear and have no idea how to use it. Um, if you're that band, I mean, you're a jerk. Okay, I, I don't know how else to say that, but if you bought gear and genuinely thought that you were gonna show up and then just have the house sound guy show you how to use that gear, First of all, there's a variety of things wrong with that. First of all, that house sound guy might not be worth a nickel, you know, and then you're going to put him and his fingers and his, you know, pro audio forum built knowledge on your brand new gear. I would probably think that through. Um, that's never good. Not to mention, if you buy new gear, you need to work the bugs out of that at rehearsal, not at the gig. You just shouldn't. I mean, unless you're replacing a piece of existing gear that you know how to use and you're just taking an old unit out and putting a new unit in and, you know, that's all fine and good. You know, but trying to trouble, especially if you're late to the gig and you're trying to expect that. And I have been through this with, with, with some people in the past and it's like, dude, I'm not here to be your technical support, you know? I'm here to run sound for the gig, not fix your gear and make your gear work. That is your responsibility. Um, now I will say this, any competent sound engineer is for hire. And if you are looking to buy gear, let's say your band is looking to go from wedge monitors to in-ear monitors, I would highly suggest that you contact someone like me, you know, who knows how to do this and just write a check and let them put the, the system together for you. Then come to your rehearsal and teach you and train you how to use it. Then, you know, you're, you're prepared. Now you're built for murder. Now you already have a scene set up in your mixer and that sort of thing. I regularly get phone calls to come out and do uh, system recalibration. Uh, in some cases, once a year, you know, I have bands that will call me to come out and run sound for them one night a year to kind of recalibrate their rig and to, you know, update their start scene. And then, you know, every gig after that, all they have to do is recall that start scene. We are for hire. So if you don't know what you're doing, do the right thing. Pick up the phone and call a sound guy that knows what he's doing, that has a proven track record, and have him come to your rehearsal and help you out. We'll gladly do that. Then when you show up at the gig, you look like a professional instead of a gang of chumps. <laughs>